Hey champs, competitors, qualifiers, and little tykes. Welcome to another quarter of Bad Sports. I'm your boy, Chad Whips. Today I'm gonna to be talking about something special. <clears throat> if you're like me, and in your late 20s or early 30s, or if you're a human being with simply some fucking awareness on your head, then you know one thing to be true. Everything was better in the 90s. So in honor of that fresh time, we're gonna play a little game I learned about two summers ago. I think it was in Charlottesville. Now this is a game that cuts right through the shit. Primal Fear style. Fuck, Mary kill. NBA Jam edition. All right, Gil, let's start it First off. First of all, you. Chad, can I just take a second to say thank you? for having me here. This has really become the best part of my week, being a part of your starting lineup and hanging with all you guys and especially seeing you and Victor and how close you guys are. Family's really important, man. Thanks for letting me be a part of yours. Okay, Gil, let's start off with you. Um, you've got a team that, like Icarus, flew too close to the Suns, the Phoenix Suns. Mm -hmm. All right, starting you off, we got Charles Barkley, Dan Marley Ow. and Kevin Johnson. Well, I'm just going to jump right into yeah, it here. Yeah, please. Uh, Dan Marley, open up because I'm going to have sex with you, <laughs> if that's okay. Does he have sex with me? Do I have? Does Player's he? choice. I mean, Dan, man, your call, bud. I'm game. Um, now here's where it gets difficult because you know Kevin Johnson, very successful politician now. Sure. You know, and as a mayor up there in Sacramento, he's getting things done. Sacramento. Doing some good things up yep. there. Um, you know, that was renowned as being, you know, just an epicenter of crime and, and, and prostitution. And KJ went in there, I assume, cleaned it up. No more. I yeah. honestly don't know how he's doing up there. I do know he is the mayor. So that's impressive. But, you know, <laughs> Charles Barkley is, like, funny. Not like ha ha funny. I mean, He's really funny, Chad. So I'm, I'm gonna marry Charles Barkley, kill KJ. I'm attracted to humor. <laughs> it's... Yeah. Hell yeah. yeah. Hell yeah. yeah. Casey, yeah. you're up. Now remember, okay. um, you just pick one person to marry, just one person to fuck, and then one to kill. You've got a, a tricky team here. We got the Seattle Supersonics. First up, Sean Kemp. Gary, the pink glove, Peyton. And Detlef Schrempf. All right. Okay, where well, I'm not gonna fuck Schrempf. Because <laughs> <laughs> why would you? I like how you said his name. Schrempf. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and who's Sean Kemp again? This guy. Oh, okay, yeah, I'd fuck him, whatever, that's fine. So, fuck. And then, Gary Payton, I know who he is. He's really cute, and I know we would have awesome looking biracial babies together. Great. And they'd be really good at sports, but not too good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then, sorry, Dimple of Shrimp, <laughs> off with your freaking head, okay? We could really, we don't need another Russian spy up in here. Yeah. He's good. I agree with you. I don't, I don't think the Cold War ever ended, so one less pinko Tommy you don't have to think about. Yeah, fuck the Reds, you know? Fuck them, not the Redskins. Best. Oh. That's oh. burgundy. All right. Whew, this is going to be an interesting one, Brooks. Um, hey, buddy, can you throw me some suds? All right, you got the, uh, you got the Minnesota Timberwolves up. So first thing, we're going to go with Isaiah J.R. Ryder. We got Chuck Liddell Person. And lastly, Kristen Lautner. Take it away. <sighs> Christian Leitner is definitely a trophy husband on paper. But been there, done that. And while he did make that great shot, I fucking hate heroes, especially student athlete ones. So, kill him. Uh, I'd fuck J.R. Ryder in a heartbeat. So I guess that leaves Chuck Person, who would probably domestically abuse me, but I think I can handle that. As some of you know, like TNT, I thrive on drama. So, Chuck Person, I do. But for real, I want to take a moment to give a shout out to my girl, Cheryl Miller. The chick who really doesn't get her due for being such a high class piece of trim. I always thought 
she'd make a wonderful mother and a great wife. <clears throat> Look, everybody knows sports are serious, but they're also a buttload of fun. So to honor the greatest decade of my entire life, I'm gonna hole up here in the bunker. I'm gonna play some Capcom games with my cousin Victor. Down our up, LYB. Yo, I, I'll, I'd come, I'll be there. Well, I got, I got fives on it. I got some games too. I don't have the consoles there at my mom and sister's place, but. Cool, I mean, we got a couple of different oh, games. Oh, I got here, widespread so can... tickets too. Or, oh, yeah, Gil. Oh, yeah, Gil. I, I owe you, yeah, you, you wanna come? Can, I got four those. tickets. Just remember, yeah. <clears throat> coming to you from the bunker, there's no such thing as bad sports. Just two points, and that ain't so bad either. I got no one to go with, but if you guys want them. Yeah, you could sell all of them. Nah, let's go together. 